Hey, welcome back to my let's play of Gunstar Heroes. My name is Orange Tadpole. I have not been saying my name a lot lately. I don't really see the point of saying my name if you can just look at the channel. Then again, there's the old thing about like somebody could steal my video and claim to be me that, that it's them doing the commentary, but you know, people aren't gonna do that. Seriously. My, for my stupid commentary, nobody cares. Nobody wants to. <laughs> nobody wants to do that. All right, so um, I'm wondering if I should just do these in, in like out of order, just to make it interesting. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the flying battleship because it's by Cap. It's piloted by Captain Orange. The flying battleship is just about to leave. Follow it! Follow it! Excelsior! Follow it! This is a, the first, actually the first level I ever played in this game. Flying battleship. Whoa. It actually looks like a battleship. Battle battleship. It's a pretty cool level. The game has great music. I'd give a shout out to a guy who does some really cool metal covers of the music in this game, but um, I don't want to butcher his name. Alex something. If you're watching this, I apologize. I do not want to sit attempt to say your pronounce your last name. Because, first of all, I can't remember what it looks like, and well, whatever. Anyways, that's orange. Orange kind of reminds me of this dude who used to sh he, we, uh, we had these family reunions and there was a guy there. And, uh, I don't know. Frank, uh, Orange kind of looked like him. His name was Frank. And we always kind of joked about that. It's Orange. And there's bombs here. I can throw them. I don't recommend doing it because if you screw up, you're going to take a lot of damage. Those are actually the flying drone enemies carrying those guys, I haven't noticed. Do we eye them? Hopefully they won't get glitch hurt here. Sometimes you get hurt there. I'm sure anyone who's played this game knows that, it's very annoying. Another phantom. Oh yeah, and if you hold down B and C, you can do that. Manta! It's like Earthworm Jim 2. Manta! Trying to do a, s a sliding pickup. Here come the turrets. don't really shoot at you in this game, unless they're turrets. They just kind of, like, tackle you and try to restrain you and stuff. It's kind of weird. And they kick. And I'm getting my ass kicked literally. Take a lot of damage in hard mode. I'm not really a fan of this laser weapon. Pick up. Let's go. Let's go. Lightsaber. Why not? Lightsaber. You can block the bullets with the lightsaber. You can actually block the bullets with the most fire weapons. You can also get sued by George, George Lucas with this one. Which is funny because uh, we got boss here swapping reg. Reg Vulcan. Reg stand for R E G. It's not very regular. Oh yeah, and I used a technique to get up on top of this thing. What you do is when you see the level kind of going up and down, you want to do a wall jump as it's going down. Like right now, it's going down. You can do a wall jump so that you have ch a time, a chance to, to actually grab the thing. As soon as it starts going down, you want to jump. 
can't really explain it when I'm fighting the boss. Um, I wonder if George Lucas has actually ever actually sued somebody for using a lightsaber. These things, they always give you health. Fifteen health, to be exact. I don't know, maybe it changes. I should know this game by heart, but I've played it so many times. That's... Crash Bazun something, I can't remember. I always just used to just call him Colonel Red, because that's... I guess I think that's what they call him in the manual. So yeah, you know what, that's Colonel Red. Well, screw it. And you don't want to throw him unless you're awesome. Like me. You can, if you ever throw him, you can do like, the attack, the aerial attack. And do a bunch of damage to him. And he goes... Action. Rotor press. Hard shoulder. And break wind. Yes. He farts on you. And you can throw him, but if you do it, you just fart him. You want crap, you keep hitting jump. You want to do it without throwing him off. Because it does a lot more damage. Or you can, if you're lucky, you have him hit the wing, and then bounce, almost did it there, off of it, and do even extra damage. Or you just want to play it safe and not get suplexed. This is not an easy boss, I'm probably going to die. I keep showing off throwing ability. Eventually, does become invincible from the shooting. Yes, one more should just about do it. Got him. All right. Now, for some reason, the helicopter plane thing will start exploding, and then I always like to try to touch both sides of the screen before I land. I can never do it, and we're back where we started. And there's orange stuck in the ground. That was quick. I didn't even time it. Alright. So that's it for episode 2 of Gunstar Heroes, the Let's Play. Stay tuned for episode 3. Hopefully, it will have been worth the wait. <laughs>